Hey guys, this is Emerald Fire, and I'm here in the new Snapshot 15 Week 33B to show you how to make a currency system using dropped items with the new stats. If I go ahead and pick up these gold nuggets, you can see I get 100 money, and then there's three in this stack and two in this stack. So each time I pick up a gold nugget, it'll give me 100 money. One, two, three, four, that should give me 400. And it does. You can do this by using stat dot pick up dot minecraft dot item name and that will increase your score in an objective that tracks this by one every time you pick up a number then you can multiply it by the value of that item that you can define and add it to your money objective if i go ahead and set display the sidebar the objective that i'm using to track how many nuggets i've picked up that's scoreboard objective set display sidebar nuggets you can see it stays at zero and then every time i pick up a nugget it will increment by the number of nuggets i pick up however it resets in the same tick so you probably won't be able to see anything no but the money does change so if i go back to money let's, uh, then yeah you see i got 400 more nuggets and it's pretty easy to do and can be done with multiple items, any item that Minecraft has in the game. To start off, you'll want to add a dummy objective to track your money. That's just this. And then you can set that to zero for all players to start tracking. And then I just put it in the sidebar here. Now to track one item in the currency system, first you're going to have to add an objective with I'm using the name Nuggets because I'm tracking Nuggets, and the type is stat.pickup.minecraft.the item name, which in this case is Cold Nugget. Then you also have to define the value that you want to set for each item. So for this, I'm using a fake player named Value, and I'm setting its score in Nuggets to 100, so each Nugget will be worth 100. If I go ahead and change this to, say, 101, you can see that every time I pick up a nugget, I get 101 points, just like that. And it's really that simple. Okay, so after that, you want to set up a clock here, and then you're going to execute at A, scoreboard players operation at P, so executing themselves, nuggets, then you're multiplying its score uh, the number of nuggets it's picked up times the value of each nugget. Then it's going to execute at all players. It's going to add to their money scores their nugget score. So it's going to change the money score. It's going to increment it with the number of nuggets times the value of each nugget. Then next it's just going to reset the nugget score and remove all nuggets from the inventory. And this is just the other side of the clock. I have it over here, so if you wanted to make a map where you're fighting monsters, you can get nuggets for a lot of money, and then you can also automatically get money from, from mob drops. So I have here Rotten Flesh and Bones. I've set the value of Rotten Flesh to 5 and Bones to 10, and these will also add into money, though if you wanted to, you could just add these into a different objective. So I'm going to head, uh, go ahead and add these, and now if I drop some rotten flesh, let's see over here, one, two, three, four, five, I should get 25 points. Yep. And if I drop some bones, let's, uh, let's get some bones, that's in here, one, two, three, four. Each of these is 10, so I'll get 40 points. And these can be mixed up, of course, so if I get one, two, three of these, let's go ahead and get two of these and some gold nuggets then it'll increment my score by however much that is. I wasn't keeping track of exactly how much it is, but I trust it did the math right. Okay, so to add one of these, I've got some template commands for you here. I'm going to do one on screen, and all these commands will be in the description. I'm going to add eggs as my next item. So here we are going to add the objective. You're going to replace items objective with the name, and I'm going to call it eggs and this is minecraft.egg. This is the value of the egg. I'm just going to call the value two, two points for each egg, and the item's objective name, which again is eggs. Okay, so now we can just go ahead and add that. 
and you can also just type these in the chat. You don't have to use command box here. But anyway, these have to be in the world because they're on the clock. I'm going to replace items objective with our objective, which is eggs. And the value, again, is eggs. Okay. Now, this is eggs again. Okay. And one more eggs, just like that. And here we're going to do the item name, which is Minecraft Egg. And that should be done. We should be good to start the clock. So let's see. Um, here we go. All right, clock is started. Now, if I throw some eggs on the ground, it should give me some points. Yes, just like that. Four eggs is eight points. Three eggs is six points. And there you go. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Oh, you know, I just realized the scoreboard might be cut off by the recording because it does that sometimes. So I apologize if you can't see the scoreboard incrementing as I do this, but I guess you can just trust me that it's adding up. And if you don't believe me, you can try it for yourself. You know what, hold on, let me just change this to 200 so you can probably see this better. Okay, so right now the score is 2,217. So if we go toss out three of these, I should get 600 points. There you go. Okay. Anyway, these commands are down here in the description. I hope this video was helpful, and I will see you all next time.